in this town. What are your steps? These are your steps. Yes, sir. I am my team. We are doing everything possible to, to arrest this. For months now, these people have been terrorizing this town, killing and destroying properties. They have even killed our officers. Or are you trying to tell me that you are incompetent? That you are overwhelmed? Ordinary women. Sir, these are not ordinary women. They are not. So they are superhumans? These women are something else. They are something else. The disturbing thing is that I even heard that the less don't even guess them. Oh, don't give me that crap. So, Inspector Luke, you have been speculating all this while. Let me tell you, if you are not serious, even as officer in charge, if you cannot arrest these people immediately, I'll 
take over this job for you. I will take it over from you. And do it myself. I promise to give you my best. I am my king. Just give us some time. We will give you the needed result. Please do your best now. Time is running out. Time is running out. Before I, 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 I get annoyed more. I promise that. You should to follow us I didn't invite you here for school today. I want to know what you have done to arrest these criminals that have been terrorizing this town. What are your steps? What are your steps? For months now, these people have been terrorizing this town, killing and destroying properties that have even killed our officers. Or are you trying to tell me that you are incompetent? That you are overwhelmed? Ordinary women. Squad six. Group of six women. This woman again. What? These are the type of mummies I would love to date. <laughs> Let be. You mean you don't give them? I mean I don't care. You can all wallow in your speculative ignorance, my dear. Hey. No, but just they gossip, they smell noses, they go. Yeah. <laughs> I tell you now, let it be. Oh, your yeah. puppet. <laughs> 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 oh, wait a <laughs> If I venture to see any woman like that, my dear, I'm sorry, don't keep passing. I trust you. This baby. Hey, yeah. 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 On a more serious note, I don't know why people will not mind their own business. I tire. Yeah. They keep up losing. Trying to know what generates money for someone else out there. I wonder. They tire me. No, now. That's what I'm saying. If I think you're in a woman, don't buy that. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, I'm, I'm I'm ready. Ready. <laughs> I wonder what will happen the day she will have an encounter with her husband. Yeah. <laughs> That's one. That's one. Can I go there and they get scores now? She won't try it. I said, come on, I said, hey, this guy. Number one. I beg. I beg. Ladies, are they more serious with us? Uh, what are you saying about my earlier suggestion about I'm going on the second official visit to the rehabilitation center? Uh -huh. You are right, Uncle Leighton. You know when you get empowered, you get blessed. You should bless the less. Less privileged. <laughs> Come on, Yoko. Nidete. Then after that, we should plan of throwing a very big so that our young young money on us. Hey! Hey! You are there! 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 My, my name is Elizabeth Frank. Yeah, thank you. Oh, sorry. Okay. 
sorry. Uh, 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 maybe we we'll exchange numbers? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, my number? Yeah, my number? Uh, zero eight zero two seven zero five eight five seven zero. Thank you. Are you call me? Sure. Frank. That's all. I'm so sorry, okay? It was caught up in traffic. Sure. Yeah. Yeah.
What the hell are you doing in this place? Do you think I'm that trap? I can't even come and hang out. I keep to hang out, of course. I hate it. We need to. We need to. Seriously. I told you I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. The way I treated you. I'm like, you don't go. Show me your gutters. You listen to me, young man. As far as I am concerned, I think I will want you to come to me for your entire life. Else, hmm. you're not gonna like me. Sorry. person you brought to our party the other day. Number one. He's kind as seen me once in the blue moon. My God. Ah, my God. <laughs> you mean he's not a weakling like Lady Bee's daughter? You know I'm blessed. So good things flow naturally to me. Us. Princess, this is not even mind of that mistake of a door. How can an energetic young looking man who left us up to five minutes on the bed? What is this? That's what I'm telling you. Just when you're about to enjoy the real ingredient. My dear, you're finding being exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> you when you're about to enjoy the good <laughs> <laughs> No more, yes, yes. Wait, wait, wait. On a more serious note, it's like this is the luckiest among us. Mm -hmm. Yes, because we all have one or two complaints with our boys. But she seems fulfilled with hers. And I'm mean, <laughs> doing everything to keep him happy. I feel it. So that he'll be loyal to always give it to me. I know. I never. I'm it. Sounds good. I strongly advise you continue to do so because if you don't play your role well, someone out there could snatch him from you. Possibly. It could be me. <laughs> Naim is saying, eh? You don't dig your grave with that. <laughs> because I'm gonna damn all consequences and send you straight to the pit of hell. Don't you try to <laughs> Come on, you go! Did it! Did it! Did What do you think? Uh, do you think it's a nice idea? Uh, well, uh, see that. Please, I need your opinion. Don't you think, uh, that might even help him to track you down. You said you have this hunch that your uncles want to kill you. Yes. And then placing a wanted note on your mom might even help them to find you. 
Don't you think so? See, you're right. You're right. But what do you think I should? Uh, Please, I need to see my mother. I'm gonna calm down, okay? I'll figure out something, okay? Henry! Henry! Calm down right now. I'm looking for the remote of the TV in my bedroom. Where is it? Okay, uh, it's on top of the table, no? Who's that up there? Uh, okay, uh, it's my friend uh, Amobi, the guy I told you about. I helped me repair my car the day my car broke down on the lonely street. Your friend mm -hmm. Amobi? Because he helped you to repair your car, he becomes your friend. Come here. Come here. Come here. So because that guy helped you to repair your car, he has now become your friend, right? How many times have I told you, you don't just see anyone on the street and call the person your friend? What do you know about their foundations? What do you know about his family? What do you know about their reputation? What does his parents do? What does he do? What do you know about him? What are the things that you can use to say comfortably that you know about him? Excuse me. Helen? Oh, babe, how you doing? All right. About 20 minutes. Which are 19 minutes and a half. <laughs> All right, I'll see you. Bye. I have an appointment. Let me rather good. Good morning. Someone, let me hear me come in. Oh, you do more. Sorry. Uh, actually, I've been wanting to talk to you. Uh, Henry, I am. Uh, are you? Are you aware that um, that your uncle was responsible for your father's death? That's impossible, man. Dad died in a ghastly motor accident, and we all know that. So we thought. So we thought. But. It was a staged a car accident. Your uncle carefully planned the murder. That's what we get out of of him. His own blood brother. As a matter of fact, he was also responsible for all the messy documents, my certificates, every paper that meant everything and anything to us. Also, the bet of the barrister. You know, I still can't. I still find it difficult. I still cannot imagine, believe that he was responsible for my husband's death. Oh no. Was that why you killed him? Henry. I don't understand what you're saying, Uncle Alex. What don't you understand there? I address you in simple English. And you're offending ignorance. You don't understand. You should understand where I'm coming from. Exactly. What exactly I'm talking about is that there is absolutely nothing designated, specifically designated, 
for you and your children. He passed everything to me. That you want. His wife. His kids. Maybe. Why? <laughs> the kids are not my brother's kids. They don't have his blood. And you don't. He told me before he died. And that was why he saddled me with the responsibility of taking care of his properties. So you must be freaking out of your mind to stand before me and utter such abominable statements about the genealogy of my kids. You know that I and my husband loved each other and the question of our kids' genealogy cannot come in place. And when you have strike you down, if you ever open that your smelly mouth to call those godforsaken products of another man's broken condom and left brother's children, every member of this double family know you are cheating on my brother. Excuse me? Yes! My brother never knew happiness. The products were these children. And my brother never knew happiness before he met his own time in death. Let's not forget. The elders have summoned you to a meeting next week in the village. And considering the volume of explanation, you will end up there. I suggest you stop dissipating your energy on frivolities. Before then, may I so tell you to have it at the back of your mind that every property belonging to my late brother in your possession and your children's possession must be really rich. I mean, everything. Everything that you see, I and my husband work for it. And my kids, Henry and Precious, have the right to their father owns, okay? Senior Advocate, in that case, you have to substantiate your claim with a legal document. We have documents, we have documents! Well, alright, as far as I know, we are now in a computer age. And every frivolous claim of this nature must be substantiated with a legal document. And until that document is produced, neither you nor your children will inherit or touch my late brother's property. Do I make myself clear, madam? Good day, madam. Honey <laughs> Moses. How did you get in here at this place? Long time. Long time, my foot. What the hell are you doing in my room? You know, there's no peace for the wicked. No peace for the wicked? Get out of here this moment. Get the hell out of here this moment before I invite the security. Um, I want you to tell me everything I need to know. Concerning the mysterious death of Matt, the mother of our family lawyer, all our missing documents, the man. What the hell are you talking about? And how do you think I have anything to do with all of this? You think I'm joking with you? Think I'm joking with you? No, Elizabeth, this is not you. This is not you. Listen, before I embark on this, I need a decision. And I'll be glad to let you know that decision. If you tell me everything I need to know, you and the family will leave. But if you fail to tell me that, I will gladly waste your generation. I swear, I'll tell you the truth. I don't know anything about that. As a statue. I'm sorry, please forgive me. Forgive me. I wouldn't have done this to your family. Forgive me, please. 
to the peace and love of my family. They killed my beloved husband. He made life miserable for my son and I. Destroyed all our documents. Cooked off all kinds of abominable lies against me. Turned me into a criminal. Rest in Your high work, thank you. Well, uh, I always keep to my promises. I don't fear. I have witnessed. Welcome. Okay, now what am I talking? <laughs> well, anything, anything for the six years be. And free. I know that. And free. with them. I don't offer fools like you in my wonderful humble home. It was time and time whatever shit that brought you. Since when? I am asking you! Since when? If you do not play your part of the past, when you almost beat me to death. Shut up! Shut up. 
Santo Espíritu de Tomé. ¿No? because I've made the money you never taught me in your entire miserable life that I'll ever make. That is why you need to start. Isn't it? I don't need your money. Maybe because of your money. I'm here because I miss you. I miss you very much. I miss you very much. You missed my money, man. <laughs> I don't need your money. 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 I'm here because ever since you left my life, things have never been shit. You hope ever you did go. Go in there! Set your house. That is. Go in there. Yeah, 
And if I do, what are you going to do? Mm -hmm. Listen. If I take you away, what are you going to do to me? Mm -hmm. Excuse me? Go ahead and do it. Do it right. Do it here. Sounds wonderful. You know what? I'm not just going to pick you up. I'm going to trust you like a child. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. I will trust you like a child. Because you cannot take my money away from me. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? You be calm down. Calm down. You must calm down. What the do you now? What do you say? Come on. Come on. You shut your head. Stop it. Let me get back. Let me get back. Let me get back. Now, if you're not a man outside, she will pick her on. All right? You can't take my money away from me. No, 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 no. You cannot do the crime of my boy. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? You are here. I am true with you. You will know what he's doing. You understand me? I have come to solicit your help. Please, you really need to help us. This that this field is rapidly turning into something else. It has destroyed the peace of our group. Just imagine, there was this deal we were supposed to strike a few days ago, but it failed simply because we've not been having meetings. Gritton, I have come to beg you. You need to do something for us, please. Do you say you also suspect that some of you, apart from Elizabeth and Kate, are also interested in young men? Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. And that's why it's getting more scary every day. We are totally divided. Um, all right. Um, I know what to do. First, you have to get me in contact with the young man in question. Okay? Okay. Thank you so much, Bitwin. I will never tolerate bad blood in my You must maintain oneness and unity. Because that's the only thing that can keep this house together. You must know that a house that is divided against itself will surely fall. So, Elizabeth and Kate, whatsoever is the dispute between the two of you must come to an end right here and now. Great one, I have nothing against you. I just wanted to leave my mind alone. Well, believe me if I say I do not know what to do. I don't understand. The young man in question. Was saw me, he liked me, and ran after me. And he chose me over you. You know, he, I did not bewitch him or lure him to myself. He just ran after me. You are a polar You know, you bewitched him because it's good for me. You know why? He will never, ever be interested in me. Nothing is like that. Then you must be gigantic to Say that. And you will break up dumb food. Enough! Enough of this nonsense. Who is this young man to bring such a dispute between the two of you? And it has also come to my knowledge that some of you here are having some secret admiration or some sort of some sort of solid affairs with the young man. Oh. And that is why I must handle this in my own way. Philo, great one. 
Did you invite the young man as I instructed you? Yes, but we can bring him in. Here is the phone. Who is it? Your friend, Kages. Yes, ma'am. Are you aware you're the reason we're all here today? Why, ma'am? You ask me why? Because the, 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 the seed you planted is bearing for fruit. You have come to destroy the peace that is existing in this group. And I guess it's working for you. Ma, forgive me if I say I don't know what you're talking about. Your unfaithful attitude is about to break the peace that exists in this group. And I won't let it be. So now I ask you to choose one among these women. You want to go steadiness. And stay away from the rest. And the rest will stay away from you. So now, go ahead and choose. choose so you mean? You heard me loud and clear. Choose. My word! <laughs> surprise, surprise, surprise! What do you think you're doing? Get away from me! I wanna go stay here with you. Me? Oh, shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! The big sexiest man. Just <laughs> hold it. What was that mellow drama you presented before? No, sis. I thought you said you were all for me. Why did you have to humiliate me before my friends? What's funny? Who is smiling with you? The big sexiest man. Hey, hey, hold it. I thought you of all people who understand me here. I should understand you how. From here what you did. Mama, I did what I did for the sake of peace. And not to hurt you. What process I took now? Success, Mama. Sit. Just go ahead and say what you want to say. I don't have Google there. Look, Mama. I went for her because I realized you all accord her with so much respect. And I know no one would definitely go contrary to her order. That is why I'm here for you. You know, I cannot have anything to do with her. It is you I want. Are you sure? Can I trust you? Mom, I cannot lie to you. Remember I gave you my promise. And I'm sticking to it. So just put on a smile on the face, please. Um, Mr. Frank, I 
was surprised that she chose me over all those women. <laughs> I'm even more surprised that you can't sing it. You know, you're beautiful as to me, just like painting on flash. So I have no option but to go for you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's it. <laughs> um, I was about to go and sit in the shower before you came. So why don't you come up inside? Let us have some trouble while I shower. Then I'll ask you to Okay? No problem. Sure. I'm all yours. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I said it that there is something strange about these women. That particular ring they all have in their fingers is not just there. It is certainly for something. Yes. So, this woman is their spiritual lord. I see. Well, Frank, you have tried. So far, so good. Please go to one. I need help. I, I, I need help. Please. His spirit has been disturbing me. I'm not at peace. I'm not rested. I, I, I can't do anything. Please, please help me. Help me, please. How are you? Calm down. I made a consultation on your behalf before you arrived. The sacrifice of a young man is needed for his spirit to stop troubling me. A young man? Yes. And after this sacrifice, the spirit will cease haunting me totally. Listen, I will give you a seed of transfer. You cover the young man with it and uncover him minutes later. Then you bring it to the sanctuary and leave the rest alone. That's all. Don't worry. Don't worry. So what do you want me to do? Apologize. Hey, <laughs> that's impossible. Now you know that. I'm not saying you should apologize to her. I only want peace to reign. That's all. So, how else do you think peace will reign if not by me apologizing to her? Can you imagine it? Huh. See who died. Who born more you? No. I can't. So what all she wants is for me to come and say sorry to her. That's not possible now. I can't be sent so as to apologize to Elizabeth. Who is she? Rubbish. My number one. If you have to do so, you do so. For peace to reign, after all, you are at fault. How am I at fault? Let's not debate over this issue, please. She met the guy first. Then she introduced the guy to you. <laughs> and the young guy says he doesn't need her anymore. So how is that my fault? Eh? <laughs> you and I know that we made this house to be together. We don't need to be divided. Of course I know. You can imagine what we have lost the spirit. For crying out loud. 
If we don't sort this thing now, it's going to get out of hand. I can't see myself apologizing to Elizabeth. What for? Hey, why? No, me, I can't. Wow. Anyway, tomorrow is our meeting with you. I know exactly what to do. I'm going to handle this thing my own way. That's entirely your business. Waiter, can we have some more champagne? You care for some more? Mm -hmm. <laughs> when you think the life is just the way you want it, when it goes off and you come down, you do the thing to life. But you forget that some things are right and some are wrong, and there will always be for you. Oh, be careful how you live your life, cause it will come back tomorrow. Oh, babe, I can't allow you to go back this time, okay? It's risky, okay? Oh, um, I'll go. But I need to go. You still go? Huh? We have a lot of vacant room here. Where you can sleep and make yourself comfortable. See here we have this thing. But believe me, if I did not get my place this time, I may miss an important appointment to go back. I'm not worry. Ah, don't you think it's bad? I don't think it's safe for you to leave by this time of the night. It needs to just pass the night. See, come on. What are you doing around? And you're not going to place this little bit? Hobby is a hobby. Say he wants to live by this ungodly hour of the night. We're begging you to sit down. I thought he was gone by now. You know, so since your friends are asking you to stay, why don't you, you know, stay back? He's not so mad. It's just that they disappoint me that I have to catch up tomorrow. And if I don't get to my place, it's like I might lose the receipt. The machine have gone since. Anyway, I mean, I leave you all to decide. If you insist on going to drop you, okay? But I am going to go. You need to see. Good night. Good night. Good night. Make sure you love her, okay? Okay. okay. I'm going to stay now, okay? Back to no money, bro. If I'm going to stay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Back to no money, I'm going to go. It's risky. I made a consultation on your behalf before you arrived. The sacrifice of a young man is needed for his spirit to stop trapping. A young man? Yes. And after this sacrifice, his spirit will cease haunting yeah. totally. Listen, I will give you a seed of transfer. You cover the young man with it and uncover him moments later. Then you bring it to the sanctuary and leave the rest to me. That's all. It has come to my knowledge that some of you still bear grudges for one another, which is bringing this group to a near class. We must trash that issue this night. But first of all, let me treat the case of Elizabeth, whose late husband's brother's spirit has been tormenting. Elizabeth. Yes, great one. Did you come with your sacrifice? Yes. With a seal of sacrifice. No! This soul has the sense of the similar blood of one of you. No. My son. My son of Wobby. My long lost son of Wobby. Good. Elizabeth. What? You have killed me. Elizabeth, help me! Shut up! How was I supposed to know it's your son? Yeah, but no! Me. No! Get one! No! No! You crazy! You knew it! Don't get out! Think the life is the way you want 
dear. When you go out and you come down, you do the things you like, oh. But you forget that some things are right and some are wrong, and there will always speak for you at the end. When you think the life is just the way you want it, when you go out and you come down, you do the things you like. Oh, but you forget that some things are right and some are wrong, and there will always be for you at the end. Oh, be careful how you live your life, cause it will come back tomorrow to tell you what you've done. Oh, he will speak for you everywhere you go in life, so try and send no matter the frustration. Oh, be careful how you live your life, cause it will come back tomorrow to tell you what you've done. Oh, it will speak for you everywhere you go in life, so try and send no matter the you know, only God knows that um, my actions were not deliberate. I mean, the young man called on me it was just an unfortunate scapegoat. He is a baby. He don't have to bother this. If no one else do, I do keep you exactly. I know you do, but you know what they say. A guilty conscience needs no accuser. Because she's guilty, she feels some delicate went after her son. But how was I supposed to know? And now she's threatening to kill my kids, especially my son. Honestly, babe, you're not going to take this lightly. It's not me. Honestly, that's no reason for you to send your kids abroad. <laughs> You know, um, when my husband was alive, he actually wanted our kids to school abroad. So I don't really send them, you know, they're actually in England school. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. In that case, you have nothing to worry about. Oh, of yes. course. I, I, I'm not going to run because of that old hag. <laughs> but it's well, it's well. It's all right. Oh, come in, the door is open. Come in, the door is open. Wow, one step in. Who do we see here? In us. us. Who do we have? How are you? Huh? Baby, baby, baby. You look good. Sit down, sit down. Okay, let's do it. What's he doing? And you must confess that. I don't understand you girls yet. Why did a sudden change your behavior? Babe, you don't have to worry about us. Come on, we are good. So, I'm happy you're around. What's the next deal? Of course. There is this chief. You should know Chief Maswe Obona. Yes, yes. The one contested for her suffering. He called out her. And will be coming to make a withdrawal of 200 million. Look at tomorrow. For his political campaign. Wait, just can you like repeat that again? 200 million naira. That's a question. That's a question. That's a question. I can, I can say this is a jackpot, like the real deal. Oh, yeah. Who would have done that? <laughs> hey! That's not like exactly. the real deal. <laughs> like, like the real deal? That's yes. Exactly. Oh, man. Oh, man. And ladies, if you follow my instructions, then this is going to be the issue. We're there, it's done. There it's done. Cool. We hit it. Right yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what, what, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What will you drink? Where are these people? 
Froggy. You know you really impressed me. Seriously, I must not force. I never knew you were going to do this kind of thing. You did yourself in between this event. You did yourself as a function. I was giving out that kind of information from them. And I'm really impressed. Seriously. She was not thinking of joining the force. Absolutely. Well, I'm really grateful. Very good. Thanks a lot. Well, Inspector. I've played my part. I think you have to pick it up from here. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You know, one thing is, um, <coughs> Giving out information from this, and that other thing is tracking them down. So, uh, I think we will still need your assistance in tracking these women down. Because tracking them down will be very difficult. Well, Inspector, you are right. This is a group of women with powerful charm. But Inspector, if I may ask, how am I going to be of help here? Yeah. <clears throat> that brings me to the main reason why I called you here. Like you said, these women are very powerful, very diabolic. So, I need to take you somewhere. To a strictly outside the rules and regulation guide in the force. But I really thought about it. There is nothing I can do. You must go there. Somewhere. Where? From the house. Relax. Don't worry, when we get to that bridge, we'll cross it. Cross the lines. Let's get there first. I'm beginning to suspect Elizabeth did this thing with me. She's not making any move at all. Oh God, instead, she moved her case out of town. This simply implies that she is ready for you. Yeah. She must have this first. Because, no matter where she and her children want to, she's okay. Exactly. Why are you rich? So many sense. So many rubbish. You know, you can't believe this. What is it? Do you know that in the midst of all of this, Elizabeth is learning to forget with Princess and Anna? You don't mean it. Ah, of course I am serious. Stephanie called me. She connected them to a pivot, and they are planning to go for it first thing tomorrow. Now you see what I'm saying. She doesn't even care if your son's life is at stake. It doesn't mean anything to her at all. Look at it. Coming after you. You have more details? Sure. Then you guys should get ready. We are going for this in Russia. Do again, I 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 do again, Huh? 
My sons, the mission is going to be different. The total is the soul is the key to the oracle of those women. You just said the, the tortoise is the key to the oracle. How can we get rid of it? How can we possibly destroy it? Mm. When a man spits into the air, the spit almost surely fall on his feet. The tortoise can be destroyed. But the key to the destruction is you. Me? No. No, you. Me? Baba, how can I possibly do that? Baba, yes, how, how, how can he destroy the, the, the oracle? How? How is that possible? I will back him. I will go with you. Thank you, Baba. Oh, no.
No matter how high an eagle flies, cannot touch the sky. The end has come. Bacalaya was a man also, young man. What's in the name of Lola Malalo? I don't know, Ever.
What am I doing here? Who changed me? Who changed me? Hello? Is anybody here?
And when you think the life is just the way you want it, when you go up and you come down, you do the things you like, oh. But you forget that some things are right and some are wrong, and there will always speak for you at the end. When you think the life is just the way you want it, when you go up and you come down, you do the things you like. Oh, but you forget that some things are right and some are wrong, and there will always speak for you at the end. Oh, be careful how you live your life, cause it will come back tomorrow to tell you what you've done. Oh, he will speak for you everywhere you go in life. So try and stand, no matter the frustration. Oh.